Warriors, it's Victoria, and I'm just coming back with another Capture and Bottle It meditation. Um, Haley in our group in CFS Warriors Academy requested that we do one where we'd be out and about in nature. And so I thought it'd be really fun to um, kind of access one of my memories for this. And this is what's called borrowing in NLP, where you actually borrow from someone else and you can experience it through their experience. And uh, this is really helpful <clears throat> when you're suffering from a limbic system uh, injury like chronic fatigue syndrome where you know you really need to calm down that nervous system but at the time it might be hard to access these feelings uh, these good and pleasurable feelings because you might be struggling with some symptoms and such so uh, anyway if, you, if you're not familiar with this technique I hope you'll go out and check the first one that I did before this video um, this is really important to do I think just in this time and what we're going through in the world because there's a lot that could be stressful and anxiety producing but the more that we practice these calm states the more we're resilient and we're able to be you know in the world in a calm centered and powerful place so those are some of the states that I'm going to be touching on during this meditation for this little technique we're going to be visiting a tropical rainforest and when i lived in maui i thoroughly enjoyed hiking in their rainforest and then coming upon a and so that little hike is we're going to dip into the states of groundedness and centeredness and then we're also going to then uh, come upon a beautiful waterfall and we're going to be exploring power and strength when we reach that waterfall so if you just like to get comfortable wherever you are if you're sitting or if you're lying down i just like you to begin to notice the weight of your body connecting with the surface beneath you and just noticing the temperature of the air on your face And let's go ahead and start with three deep breaths, a little deeper than what you've been breathing all day. As you take your breath, you might just hold it for a beat at the top before you exhale. And as you exhale, just notice your muscles loosening, your body relaxing. Noticing that there's nothing you need to do right now. There's nowhere to be. You can just be here. Taking another deep breath. Letting go. Letting go any tension you might be feeling. Allowing yourself to just Get comfortable in the position that you've chosen. And as we walk through this meditation, you can just follow the sound of my voice. If you wander from it from time to time and go off in other thoughts, it's not a problem. It's very normal and natural. Just bring your thoughts back to my voice and it will lead you through this beautiful tropical hike that we'll be going on. So this is just a memory that I'm accessing, being in Maui, a beautiful tropical island in the Pacific Ocean. Gorgeous rainforests clinging to its mountains. There's a beautiful place I would hike. It was called the Seven sacred pools of Maui. And on this hike, I would notice the earth beneath me, dark brown, just after a nice refreshing rain. The leaves around me on the trees were still dripping with water, raindrops dropping around me.
there was a beautiful hushed quiet being in this jungle. A quietness that almost enveloped me. The quiet of the jungle. And I could also hear every now and then the beautiful call of a tropical bird or the fluttering of wings passing overhead. I noticed as I walked through this tropical forest, the gnarly roots beneath my feet making me feel so grounded as I noticed their beauty, stepping over them in the soft, damp earth. Now coming into a bamboo forest, the bamboo stalks like weeds. Small and dense together. So they created their own forest. It was beautiful. The yellowish brown bark. The leafy green leaves. Beautiful scent of the jungle. Tropical flowers. Filling the air with her beautiful aroma. Noticing their color as I walked along the well-trodden path. Beautiful pops of red, pink, purples, and whites. Bending over to smell their luscious scent. So refreshing, so renewing. And in this beautiful tropical garden, this forest, as I walk along, sinking my feet in the damp earth, noticing the towering trees above me, I feel grounded and centered, at peace with myself. I can feel that beautiful groundedness coming up through my feet from the earth. If it had a color, I would choose this deep leafy green that I see all around me. The lush colors of a tropical forest. And now I feel that leafy green deep green color moving up my feet, up through my legs, bringing a sense of groundedness and centeredness to my being. That green color moving up through my torso in waves, bringing healing as it flows through my body, a sense of centeredness, Calm, quiet, just like the forest. And now that color is coming up through my chest, flowing over my shoulders and arms, up through my neck. Healing in its waves, calming my system bringing that sense of centeredness, 
knowing, being. This comes up through my face, all the way up through the top of my head and overflows this beautiful green color. Every cell in my body responding to its healing power. The power of being grounded and centered. Just noticing that. Just noticing what I see in this forest. What I feel in this forest. How connected and grounded. Now walking along this path, I begin to hear the, the roar of a waterfall. It's a beautiful backdrop to the scenery, even though I can't see it yet. It brings an excitement and an eagerness as I press ahead deeper into this forest. And now I come to it. It's a beautiful, beautiful tropical pool shrouded in thick foliage, leafy greens and flowers. And above that pool, huge black rocks with beautiful foaming, glistening water flowing over those rocks into the pool. Even the, the moisture in the air becomes more intense now as I watch this powerful water flow. It fills me with a sense of strength and power and an energy that is grounded and connected to my being. Droplets of water spray from this waterfall. So even though I'm at the other end of the pool, I can feel the spray on my face. I can see the rippling across the pool from the force of the water. And now I go ahead and dip my feet into this pool. It's refreshing. It's cool. As I allow myself to dip all the way in and submerge before I come back up. Feeling so enlivened by the water. And I take my time as I approach the waterfall, excited to stand beneath its flow and a little bit nervous. Will it be too hard on me or will it be easy? But I know I have to do it because I'm this close to it. So I make my way through the the clear water, till that water is flowing over me, over my head and through my, across my chest and through my arms, feeling the power and the strength of that water as it flows over my body, invigorating me, filling me with strength and power. Noticing what this feels like to have the energy of that waterfall in my body. I relax and move myself from underneath its flow, 
floating on the surface of the water. Relishing in what that waterfall felt like. Stony waves filling up my body, filling up my soul with power and strength. And as I lie back in the water, looking up at the leafy green jungle surrounding me, noticing the flowers dotting the landscape, hearing the distant call of a tropical bird, I just take it all in. Just noticing that. Noticing what I see. Hearing what I hear. Feeling what I feel. Knowing that in the days and weeks and months to come, this beautiful green sense of groundedness and centeredness that I received from the forest goes with me into the coming days, bringing a calm and a centeredness to all my days. And knowing that that beautiful waterfall is only a moment away whenever I wish to close my eyes and imagine being under its powerful force, feeling that strength and power from the water and how that flows in a beautiful, creamy, flowing waterfall across my days and weeks and months to come. Bringing stability, strength, and power to my very being. And just noticing what that feels like. And the wonderful thing is anytime I choose, I can go back on this forest hike and reconnect with that leafy green feeling of connectedness and groundedness. And that white foamy sense of power and strength. programming this into my brain, into my neural pathways. So it serves me all the days of my life. And in a moment, we're going to come back to the present moment. So I'd like you to begin to notice the temperature of the air on your face, the space of the room that you are in, perhaps stretch, stretching your muscles and your arms and your legs, bringing back with you all the relaxation, all that sense of groundedness and connectedness all that sense of power and strength with you. Your subconscious mind storing it exactly where it needs to be stored. And now when you're ready, you can gently open your eyes and have a fabulous day.